my feet. There's nothing. Yeah. Get out. Still spinning. That's a hundred fifty day. Okay, it's still raining. There's nothing we can do. But watch you. The watch you move. Roman pet holiday. She didn't find someone who has yet to see this. Is Naoto. Yes, this is Jirogane. Something to marry, Senpai. The movies? I believe that my schedule permits me to take some time to relax. I hear the sound of people in the background. Are you at the theater already? I'll see you later. Right, I'll meet you there. Very sorry to keep you waiting. Huh? Are we the only two here? But then, that would... Let's go. Nothing, never mind. Let's watch the movie. You and Naldo take in a movie together. Your heart fluttered watching an elegantly spun love story unfolding in the city of Rome. Enjoy watching the movie with Naldo. Something inside of Naldo changed in response. Paris bonuses were granted by watching the movie. That wasn't bad. I don't really go to the theater much because I don't have anyone to go with. It's nice to watch a movie in company. I wouldn't mind doing that again. It's enjoyable. Stay tuned, fight me out again with you. Let it go. Can we get a tutor today? And that's what we're gonna do. Tutoring. Yes. Sorry about what happened last time. That's kind of ugly. Says nothing for a while. The awkward silence continue. Today's dead in circle on the calendar. Oh, that's right. Today is my birthday. I forgot. Happy birthday. Don't forget next time. All is zero, but I'm gonna say happy birthday anyway. There's nothing to be happy about. Who looks ready to cry? Mom forgot it too. It's not even here. Who looks sad? Half a grand celebration, half a modest celebration. It's all zero too. Half a modest celebration. You decide to throw a birthday party for you. First, you need keg, Junus, present, gas. Okay, we need. Okay, I'm going to take a cake. You need to get a cake. Only one place spring to mind. Junas. You decide to call Yosuke. Yo, what's up? You explain the situation to Yosuke. I get it. Well, I can't see why you want to help the kid out. Leave it to me. Just text me the address and I'll find direction to his house later. Well, I won't be long, okay? Huh? What? You decide to wait for Yosuke to arrive. Who is in total shock? <laughs> hey, I called the whole gang. It's cool, right? 
you are going to have a small celebration, but Yusuke invites everyone. Sheesh! Yusuke just called us up out of the nowhere, you know? He was all, made us a Juness. I was worried there for a moment. <laughs> but a surprise party like this? It's the kind of surprise I like. Yes! Me too, but we have to start this up right. With a song. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Shukun. Happy birthday to you. She's still in sock. Come on, now for the candles. Blow them out. Huh? But <laughs> if you don't hurry, you'll end up with a wax flavor cake. And no one wants that. Now come on, blow. Uh, okay. One, two. She takes a deep breath. <coughs> it got dark. The likes. Hit the likes. Hey, who did that? It's not me! Ack! No kicking! Hm? Huh? Isn't the switch somewhere around here? Ah! Oh. Ah! Uh, I'm sorry, I'll get the switch. No, my fault, huh? Is this your face? Uh, yes, let go of my nose. I'm sorry! I'll just sit back down. You're stepping on me! <sighs> I'm sorry. Wait, where am I? Sheesh, Yukiko. Let me handle this. Ow! Right in the solar plexus. Everyone, just sit down. You, get the likes. <laughs> Is the kick okay? You kidding? That's the first thing you asked about? Well, let's put the whole mess behind us. Happy birthday! Thank you! How old are you? Uh, 13. I mean, 14. Wow, that's young. Man, it must be great being in the prime of one's youth. You're high school. You're, the, you're in the prime of your youth. Um, you're not exactly an old lady, you know. Oh yeah, you can know what I mean. But um, Shukun, your life is only beginning here. You can go smile gently at you. Oh yes, man, you have no idea when it to turn on the kid. I mean, it's nothing. Just the day I was born. Yep, it's a time for a celebration. It's a reason to be happy. Should I have been born? Chu mumbled to himself. Stupid! 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 Surprise! Of course you serve! To the surprise. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, now for the cake. For the cake, for the cake. <laughs> yes, let's all have a slice. The party living up at this point. It's getting late, so everyone went home. Um, thank you. I... do begin to cry. I... I was suspended from school. I'm sorry, Sensei. I cheated. Also worried about the task. If I was number one, I took... No point in anything if I'm not the best. It's all I can be. If I'm not, mom won't love me anymore. Mom asked me why I did it. She said she was betrayed, embarrassed. She said, I'm not her son. She was crying. 
to begin to sob. Told him. Wait for him to come down. Wait for him to calm down. He waited for Sue to calm down. I... I'm sorry. <sighs> and when I was able to write my name for the first time, Mom praised me. She would tell anyone who would listen that I was a genius. So I did my best. I studied all the time so I could live up to her expectation. So that people would accept that mom could raise a child on her own. I always had to be number one. But then he, that transfer student came along. The school he came from was ahead of us and he always got perfect score on the test. Plus, he's good at sport, good at talking to people. He became the base in everyone's eyes. And they all start laughing at me. I know that all I'm good at is studying. No, I don't even have that. Studying all days. No clubs, no friends. What do I have left? I don't have anything. I'm nothing if I'm not number one. If everyone, if even mom gives up on me. I'm scared. Cheating was the only option I had. That's what I told. So I... Sorry. Sorry. To begin crying again. Comfort him. Kindly reason with him. Sternly scold him. Kindly reason with him. You gently explain to Sue that he should never do it again. Your diligence has increased. Yes. I won't ever do it again. Tim Su understand. It's mom. Back. I... Go talk with her. Thank you, mister. Thank you. But today, I was happy. Sue tries to get emotion under control. You felt that your relationship with Sue has grown even deeper. Ranks up, rank 9. The Twitter student social link has reached level 9. The power to create personas of the tower arcana has grown. Come back again. I'll do my best. He left shoe house and went home. The rain doesn't seem to be letting up. You have the day off from school today. You've done everything you could do. All you can do for now is wait for Nanako's recovery. What should you do today? You realize that you haven't booked anything from the home shopping program this week. Maybe you should watch it. Okay, let's watch it. Which program would you watch? Watch the where or cast watch the shopping program. You hear infectiously cherry song. Hey come, Tanaka, over the airwave to you. Hello everyone, welcome to Tanaka Amazing Commodities. Grantor of your desire. This is Tanaka Amazing Communities, the mail order television program being broadcast live to you. We grant you your purchase will meet your satisfaction for a fair market price. Now let's introduce the product available for these three days. It's Angel Skirt. It mystic power protects you. Oh my goodness, I can't believe its wonderfulness. I ate diet food times two to your Angel Skirt for a low price of only 59,800 yen. We've got another fantastic product on sale today. Soma, a sort of juicy beverage. Okay, so am I is it? It is. Okay, since there's nothing I could do, I'm going to eat at Aya. And uh, show you when we are finishing.
Tensor Shopping District Chinese Diner Aya accept the rainy day special mega beef bowl challenge. You still can't see the rice. You begin to suspect that your bowl is a portal to the meat dimension. The amount of meat contained within this bowl is truly staggering. In order to finish this bowl, you must have understanding of your limits, knowledge to control your pace, courage to face this unrelenting tide of beef, and the diligence to preserve against the colossal challenge. All these traits are necessary to master the rainy day special mega beef bowl challenge. However, you are confident you can finish it. You finish your meal. You try your best to finish the rainy day special mega beef wall challenge. And your personality has grown tremendously. Your knowledge has increased. Your courage has increased. Your diligence has increased. Ah, yeah, I'm amazed you finished that entire thing. That you added all your meal is free. Thank you. I always think when I see you that you eat a lot. Flipping kids grow tall and eating kids grow wide. Not you and my daughter though. Eat, exercise, and get plenty of rest. That's the secret of staying healthy. After finishing your meal, you went home. Okay, today's the last day. For you to and get now the weather. Uh, Nanako, if you fail, this is will be a game over. But it is not. So uh, since you already received Nanako, so it's not game over. And like usual, uh, it show you the weather report. And now the waiter. The week ended on a wet note as rain clouds moved into the area. As a result, a thick fog is expected to form in the Inaba region later tonight. It seems the wall fog will set in tonight. And like usual, they will force us to watch Midnight Channel. Even though we don't want to. Turn to your room and watch the Midnight Channel. Watch TV in your room. At night. The fox has that in. No one is appearing on the midnight channel. Nanaku has been rescued and you were able to arrest the culprit. There's probably no need to watch the Mina channel anymore. Really? Fox is covering the town. No one's there. The fox from yesterday is still there this morning. Oh, there he is! Take a look at this. Namatame is in today's paper. The front page headline article said that Namatame has regained consciousness. Two days before dawn, the suspect Taro Namatame, who had been confined in a local hospital, regained consciousness. In response to police questioning, he testified that he is sorry for what he has done and was scared. From here on, the police are hoping to solve the entire case based on the suspect's deposition. So it's finally over. Yeah, seriously. Seriously? In a court? You know, you throw people on TV? That's gonna work? In a court? I wish we could have done it sooner. Isn't the fog kind of thick this morning? And it's so chilly. <sighs> <sighs> it rarely gets this cold in November. November. Oh, it's you guys. Perfect timing. I just got a call from the hospital. They said that starting today, it's okay to visit Nanako-chan. 
So she's getting a little better. Thank goodness. Oh, is that today's paper? So you already know about him. Oh, no, Matame Jilling. What is charged with? Is it finally over? What is charged with? Two counts of kidnappings and murder and five counts of attempted murder. Those are serious crimes. I think it'll go down in history as one of the worst sprees in Japan. He's still mentally unstable, but we're slowly piecing together a story. This is still a secret, but I guess it's okay to tell you guys. You know that diary we found? There were entries about Miss Yamano and Miss Konishi in it. Looks like Namatame had been making advances on Miss Konishi. What? That son of a bitch! Yeah, well, I'm gonna head to the hospital now. Dojima-san's recovering too, so I need to go over a few things about this case with him. Damn it, Namatame. Yosuke. I mean, you know, Saki Konishi is just a high school student, man. What kind of perfect are you? Sorry, I'm alright. Namatame's been caught. He can't hurt anyone now. But forget him. Let's all go visit Nanako-chan after school. Agreed. Of course! Let's tell the others once we get to school. Okay guys, I think that's it for today's. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.